Mastering Sadhana, on retreat with Anthony de Mello, by Carlos G. Ayes is a captivating exploration of the profound spiritual journey of a group of individuals led by the renowned Jesuit spiritual teacher, Anthony de Mello. Through Valle's insightful narrative, the book delves into the transformative power of retreats and the teachings of de Mello, providing readers with a deeper understanding of the concepts of spiritual growth, mindfulness, and self-discovery. Valles employs vivid language and evocative descriptions to paint a vivid picture of the retreat experience. He portrays the setting as a serene oasis, enveloped by nature's tranquility, where participants gather to embark on a journey of self-exploration. The author's intricate detailing of the surroundings serves to enhance the reader's immersion into the retreat atmosphere allowing them to vicariously experience the serene environment that fosters introspection and connection. At the heart of the narrative is Anthony de Mello, a charismatic spiritual guide who leads the retreat ants through a series of thought-provoking discussions and experiential exercises. Valles presents de Mello as a wise and compassionate teacher whose words resonate deeply with the participants. De Mello's teachings center on sadhana, a term referring to a disciplined spiritual practice aimed at self-realization. Valles elucidates how De Mello's teachings emphasize the importance of transcending the limitations of the ego and embracing a state of mindfulness that enables individuals to perceive the world with clarity and detachment. One of the central themes explored is the notion of detachment. Valles expounds on how de Mello encourages participants to detach themselves from their attachments and desires, which often lead to suffering. The author skillfully weaves anecdotes from the retreatants' experiences, showcasing their struggles and breakthroughs in understanding the concept of detachment. Through Valles' narration, readers witness the gradual unraveling of the participants' attachments, symbolizing their growing awareness of the mental and emotional burdens they carry. Valles also delves into the practice of mindfulness as a means of self-awareness and inner transformation. He illustrates how de Mello introduces various mindfulness exercises during the retreat, guiding participants to observe their thoughts, emotions, and sensations without judgment. Through Valles' words, readers grasp how mindfulness aids in dispelling the illusions of the mind and fostering a heightened state of consciousness. The author emphasizes how this practice equips individuals to respond to life's challenges with equanimity and grace. Moreover, the book underscores the significance of breaking free from societal conditioning and exploring the true nature of one's identity. Valles elucidates how de Mello's teachings encourage participants to question their beliefs, assumptions, and labels that society imposes on them. Through introspective exercises and open dialogues, retreat ants confront the layers of conditioning that mask their authentic selves. Valles' narrative artistry captures the participants' moments of revelation, showcasing their blossoming into individuals unburdened by societal expectations. In conclusion, Mastering Sadhana, on retreat with Anthony de Mello, by Carlos G. Ayes offers readers an illuminating journey into the realm of spiritual growth and self-discovery. Through Valles' eloquent storytelling, Readers become intimately acquainted with the transformative power of retreats and Anthony de Mello's profound teachings. The book's emphasis on detachment, mindfulness, and shedding societal conditioning guides readers toward a deeper understanding of their inner landscapes. Valles' narrative brilliance not only transports readers to the retreat setting but also catalyzes their contemplation on the universal truths of human existence. 
Mastering sadhana stands as a testament to the potency of spiritual retreats in facilitating personal evolution and enlightenment.